they've only gone and bloody done it again. So the developers of Into the Breach, aka the developers of FTL, have released a free update, the advanced edition of Into the Breach, just like they did with uh, FTL. That's good, isn't it? So let's play it. I love this game. Uh, I have one in progress, but I'm going to actually just, yeah, because let's get into the new stuff. So, so all the ones I've got unlocked, um, Rift Walkers, the, 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 this lot, and them, that was what what was available before. I didn't earn the secret squad. You had to get all these coins. I didn't get all of them. But now there's one, two, three, four, five, and the secret squad uh, to unlock. And fortunately, I was saving up for the secret squad, so I can unlock a bunch of these. So, what do we have here? Bomber mechs, arachnophiles, heat sinkers, mist eaters, and cataclysm. So this one has explosives and flexible weapons. This one uses the dead Vec, those are the, the, the enemy, uh, to power them. This uses airborne particles of the nano repair stuff. This this uses fi these guys use fire, fire, and these guys are land manipulation. So uh, I kind of like the sound of that. I'm going to try this. Cataclysm, look at that. Hydraulic lifter, throw an adjacent unit and damage it. Okay, damage and push three tiles, nice. Damage and flip target if tiles. Oh, crack the adjacent. Oh, yeah. So you can actually destroy the terrain. I think after one extra, cr one more crack, and it will it will break, turn into a hole, and the floor will give away. And yeah, let's play. Uh, oh, oh, oh! Advanced content. Advanced Vec enemy types. Yeah, let's do it. Advanced missions. Yes. Equipment. Advanced weapons and pilots. Yes. Advanced pilot abilities. Yes. Let's see. Easy, normal, hard, unfair. I'm gonna go for it. I'm gonna go. This is this is pro into the breach. I'm not playing unfair because because it's, it's unfair. That's not fair. Let's try it. Defend the artillery support. Protect the power generator. Okay, do it. Okay, so it looks like we have some artillery support here. That's nice. Uh, let's just. Oh, we can only place in this small area. Interesting. Uh, okay, begin. Hundreds of people in this building. Make sure they stay standing. I'll do my best. Okay. So, the way this works, in case you haven't seen my previous video or if you're not familiar with the game, uh, the enemy attacks are all totally telegraphed. So, we know exactly what they're going to do. And they will con they will do this even uh, uh, regardless. So, if I move, you know, somehow move uh, this, this guy over here, he will shoot in this direction. These guys will... You know, so basically it's easier to show you than to tell you. Damage one and push them. Okay, so we could push push them aside like that, but it wouldn't kill them. So this guy, even though he'd be pushed to here, he'd still hit this, this here. I can safely move this guy just out of the way for now, because he's just going to harmlessly shoot this forest, which, you know, is a shame, but we're trying to protect people here. Uh, let's see. Throw an adjacent unit. Okay. Hmm. So you really have to think ahead about what you're going to do with these with these things. So give me a minute and I'll think. Okay, so I'm going to move this guy here. And then use this guy. Oh. oh, I can only throw him to a particular place. Yeah, so I can throw him but only forwards. Okay, that's not ideal. Let's rethink. Uh, you can always undo a move, so that's handy. Yeah, I wanted to pick him up and throw him over here into the way of this, but that's not going to work. We do have this artillery here. It can only move in a very small area, though. Yeah, that's not too useful. Although, if I move this guy here, I can move all of these. Yes. Then the artillery can come here and shoot those two. Perfect. Okay. Now, this guy is too far to do anything useful. I wonder if I can throw him into the mountain. No, I can just throw him there. He'll shoot the mountain, but that's okay. Like, ideally, I'd want to chuck him onto there. So these are the spawn tiles. This is where the Vec will emerge from. If I could get one of them onto it, not only will it stop them emerging, but it will also damage uh, the Vec that's standing in front of it. I'm just going to pick him up and throw him there. Oof. Okay. Okay, the only one of great concern is this, because we need to stop this one from shooting our buildings. 
Now, it shows the attack order. Where does it show the... Oh yeah, if we hover, hover over here. So, this one will attack first, and then this one second, and this one third. So, with that in mind, if we pick up this boy and throw him there. Now, he's going to hit that one, and then you're just going to shoot the mountain, so that's fine. I can just take this out with the artillery. Perfect. Okay. Now, if I move him here, he's going to block the emerging vec and take a bit of damage, but we can deal with that. And... Wait, what does this do? Flips the target. That's no good, because he's going to shoot him. Okay, undo that. Yeah, there's a lot to think about. It's like... It's like chess if you know what your opponent's going to do and they cheat. Yeah, there's not a lot I can do here. I'm just going to block one Levesque with you and move you into position. I'm not going to shoot... I could shoot you. Actually, that is better. Because even though you'll... Yeah, because you'll only do one damage. So, I might as well. Oh, that's the same. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. It's all the same. Yeah, it requires a lot of... Uh, forethought and thinking this. It's not the best game to let's play, but... Ooh, this is a new type of Vec. These floaty boys have a, um, have a kind of passive effect that... Oh, boosted units. Plus one damage until next time it attacks. Okay, so that's what this is doing. So you're not attacking. You're attacking that way. All I need to do is, like, move. And you're gonna... destroy that. I can just kill you with this artillery. This mission isn't too bad. How many turns have we got left? Two turns. Okay. Um, I could grab you and throw you there. Yes. Now, when the truck Vec tries to merge, it will kill this thing. Uh, I can hurt these two. Uh, that. I like that. Yes, yes, yes. And then I just need to use the artillery to kill you. Okay. And you, I'm not finding a lot of use for you, but, oh, tell you what I could do. I could grab you and flip you. Oh, that will... I just want to see what happens. Yeah, crack the tiles. Excellent. So, they'll turn to holes if damaged again. Excellent. Yes. Okay, I think we're good. I think we're good. Yeah. I mean, technically, we could just move and we'd win because, uh, you know, that's that would be the end of it. But let's uh, do as much damage as we can. Um, what do we want to do here? Yeah, if I, when you push something into something, it will it will do the, it will take some damage by hitting it. So there, excellent. Uh, hmm. Kind of want to try this. Uh, so I'm going to throw you there. Boom. And then... Oh, it didn't damage the tile. It didn't, uh... Cra it didn't, like, double hit it. So, I guess that just needs to be damaged by regular weapons fire. In order to... Let's try. Let's see what happens. Uh, yeah. Excellent. Oh, it's a chasm. These are great, because you can just push things into them. It's hilarious. Okay, good. Alright, let's try... End with eight spaces on fire. How are we supposed to do that? Some of the trees are ancient, but we must protect our relics. I'm not sure. So that's a different mission type. <laughs> we could try it. We could try it. I think you just have to attack a forest square to set it on fire. So, yeah. That'd be good for the fire squad, wouldn't it? We have the firepower improving naughty boy here. Uh, yeah, how are we going to set things on fire? That's the question. Uh, this guy's going to be great at setting things on fire. What are you doing? You're not even attacking. You're an idiot. So I can hit all of these three spots. Yes. Three tiles on fire. Good. Just, just damage you and flip you. There we go. Set him on fire, and uh, they'll take one damage at the, at the end of their turn or the start of their turn or something. Okay, let's just let's just throw you here. Why not? Okay, good, good enough. Yes, fire damage. 
burn you bastards. Oh no! Oh, he's he's caught me, but I can throw him, and that will break the the webbing. This one's a problem. How am I going to deal with that? I can flip him with this guy, but he's just going to face this building instead. Uh, you can't move. The only thing you can so either I move this guy through some other means. Uh, I don't know how I would do that because I can't get this guy anywhere to shoot him because you can only fire in, in, in straight lines along the, you know huh, I think I'm going to have to throw you that but that doesn't really he's still oh dear, this is a problem okay, I'm going to have to do this that's going to hit me now, that's no good Oh, that was stupid. Okay, um... Yeah. I'm gonna... Okay, so you get one of these per, per mission. I'm gonna reset. So it's like a time warp thing. And then we get to redo our turn. I can't do that again, this, this mission. So I've gotta think now. You know, I don't think there's any other way to do it. I cannot hurt this guy. I mean, I can hurt him. But not enough to kill him. Um... I can't get anywhere where I can shoot him with this guy, and this guy can't move. All he can do is throw, and no one else can get to this either, so I'm just gonna have to do exactly what I did before. Ah, uh, that's no good. At least the shield will protect you from this one. Well, we're just gonna have to take the hit, I'm afraid. Yeah. So this is the power grid here. This is basically your, your health bar. When that gets to zero, your, 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 your round's over. So this is a roguelike. Have, uh... Oh, we resisted! It's a 15% chance. That's good. That was that was very fortunate. The gods are with us. Okay, the gods are fucking with us again. Look at this. Look at this. I'm being fucking surrounded. It's obscene. I didn't I didn't didn't like, don't like it. Fire takes place before any attack. So this one is going to burn before it gets a chance to attack. This one is going to do one damage, this one's going to do one damage. So we would survive this, in fact. Um, this wouldn't actually be fatal to this mech. So that's okay. All we need to do is deal with these two, really. So I can... Because this one's a flyer. It, do, it doesn't get stuck in the water, so I can attack this one and make it flip. That's good. And then you, I can throw you... Uh, here is good I, I I mean hmm yeah if I throw you there then you're gonna block a vec and take some damage and then this one all I need to do is kill you and burn an extra bit of forest there we go we got the uh, the, the forest spaces are all on fire excellent yes burn good take it. Oh, you're also on fire. That's not good. I could get in the water to put that out or use my repair ability. If I take this one here, it is going to catch fire, but it's not going to take enough damage before the round is over for that to matter. So I can kill both of them. Okay. And then I can throw you there. And if I go here hit you like that, you will take fire damage and die, and then they're all dead. Yes, yes, we're okay, we're okay, good. We got them, the Vec are all dead. Yeah. It's a really cool game, I, I love the this, this, this strategy, it's almost like a puzzle game, in a way, you know, because the, the way that you have to solve each, each mission Let's see, don't kill the volatile vec. I don't like the sound of don't kill. Block vec spawning three times, protect the power plant. Okay, this one's easier because you only get one star. So the stars, the, the reputation is used to buy upgrades at the end of each mission, each, each island. So let's just do this one. Okay. Ah! Time pods, yeah. So this game has a kind of time loop mechanic going on, and if we grab one of these time pods, we'll get some some kind of upgrade or perhaps a new pilot. 
Uh, but if it gets destroyed, obviously that's, uh, that's the end of that. Okay, I'm going to bring you here to block the Vec. Flip you, so you shoot harmlessly in that direction. Uh, you can go here and shoot this guy, so he's just attacking the mountain. And then you can... I could throw you, but your attack is two, line, two things long, so he's still going to hit me. Uh, I think I'm just going to go here and block this spawning. And I actually have to do that three times for this mission, so that's uh, that's good. Okay. Good. Okay, we lost the shield, but that's fine. It just protects you from one hit. You can deal with that. Okay, this gives me an idea. I can over here and throw you there and then you can hit both of them. Uh, oh, that's going to actually kill you, so that's not relevant. Wait, oh, I already moved this one and then I didn't, and then I did something else so I can't undo it. Never mind. Okay, just go there, push this one. Good. Doesn't really matter what we do, but there we go. Okay, good enough. This one's on one health now, so I really need to be careful. Okay, I have an idea. I'm going to throw you there. And, oh no! Oh, I should have checked. I can't. I wanted to, him, him to come here and shoot them that way. And this is a problem. This is a real problem. Uh, mm, yes. Okay, I'm gonna have to reset. Okay. Oh! Okay, I definitely want you to go there and throw you that way. Oh, that's a problem. I have to damage my own guy. I'm gonna do that. I could do this. And then have you just. F yeah, okay. Hit you to flip you. You go there, kill you. Okay, we're good. Whew. Okay, this one poses a problem. <laughs> I think I can do this. I think I need you to do this. And then, hmm. Yes. Then you go here. Wait, no. No, that won't work. Damn it! Okay, okay. Uh, oh, yes. I have an idea. You're just gonna hit you and then you are going to come here and flip you. There we go. Okay. Oh no! This one, oh no! I'm going to lose this mech. Oh crap. Oh no. I didn't, oh wait, no, it, it died from fire. Excellent. Yay, dying from fire. <laughs> okay. Perfect. Ooh. It's always so tense. We're all okay. Yay. Pod recovered. Yes, what's inside? Ooh, grid assault. Overload the grid, causing a building to damage push and attack adjacent as well. Does that damage the building? Oh no, it causes the the building to push and a, and a damage. And that's really cool. That's pretty cool. And a reactor core that lets you upgrade. Can I do that now? Yes. It's been a while since I played this, so uh, yeah, that's a really good upgrade there, building immune, it means I can I can have buildings within the sphere of, uh, within the, the line of being hit, without a problem this one does 1 plus damage, I kind of want that do I? Oh, well I'm doing it now, okay fine, yeah I'm making decisions a little more quickly for the sake of the video, even though I can edit everything but whatever <laughs> okay 
Okay, this one looks nasty and yellow. It looks poisonous. Don't eat this feck. It's very big. And poisonous. Okay. It's a volatile. Oh no! Oh, I, was, I didn't read it. This is a volatile vec. I mustn't let this die. Why? Let them die! Ooh, I just realized I can do something fun. Watch this. Splosh! <laughs> he got dunked on. Okay. I can't shoot this one into the water because then it will kill it and that will be bad for some reason. Uh, but I can flip you. Flip you. Uh, and you're still going to kill you, damage you, so I'm going to hit you. Should have made it building me. It's fine. There we go. Okay, obviously this doesn't fall in because it's flying. It's got me. Okay, I can't actually... Oh, no. Okay, I think I can throw it. Uh, let's see. Yeah, if I throw it there, it won't kill it. That's fine. Okay, it's got one hit point left. I mustn't let it die. God, it's hard enough protecting the buildings, let alone the fucking Vic. Alright, I'm just gonna hit you a bit and damage you. There we go. Vec emerging! Hit him hard. Oh dear. This is a problem. I guess the shield is good, because then it won't actually do any real damage. Oh no, this is a problem. Uh, okay, you can just shoot that way and that's fine. Uh, hmm. Oh dear. Damn it. I can't... Oh wait, this. Uh, oh, I can do it to. I can. Ooh, I can do it to any building. It doesn't just have to be ones I can like see in a line of sight. That's really powerful. The problem is, if I do it on this one, it'll push him into this building. That's no good. Okay, that's a rare ability that can target in a non-linear way. That's really powerful. Okay. Uh, so the problem is these two. I can't actually protect both of them. I don't think there's any way. Hmm. Unless. No. This one attacks second, so it won't be able to kill that one before. If I was move that to there somehow, even though I can't do it. Whatever. Ah. Uh, sometimes. You just can't save everybody. It sucks. The pen must have saluted me. Not after this. After this round. The uh, least we can do is. Rent is taking more damage. Okay, we're gonna we're probably gonna lose this building though. Yes. Killing innocent people. Yep, that's what they do. Oh no! What are we gonna do now? Like, we either let it destroy these buildings. I mean the thing is, I think it's gonna blow up. Yeah, explodes on death, dealing one damage to all adjacent tiles, so... Oh, man. I can't push it in any way without damaging it and then blowing it up. So it's, I either take the hit to... I either don't get a star or I lose one one of these. But this... Oh, this one's going to shoot it anyway. Oh, man, I can't... St uh, unless I move this one, it's... Oh, it's so tricky. Let's just do the best we can. Um, I think I want to protect the building. There we go. So be it. Okay, and for good measure I'm going to throw you in the water. Sploosh! There we go. Good enough. <laughs> I was hoping there'd be more ability to create holes like this, but it's just this one and it's kind of difficult to pull off. But I guess it would be too too powerful otherwise. Ah! New skill unlocked popular hero. Sells for four reputation. Okay, that's cool. Okay, boss time. Let's take on the boss. What is 
this? I've not seen this. This is a new one. Starfish leader. Oh, how cute. Oh, God. It's got an eight directional attack. That's bad. That's really bad. What the hell? Uh, deal four oblique tiles. D a damage for three damage to. F Wait, which ones are pushed? Oh, it's damaging the diagonal oblique, I guess, and pushing the others. Interesting. So it's gonna, yeah, it's gonna damage the building. And oh, this is complicated and interesting. <laughs> right, I think the first thing I want to do is do this. Yes, good. And then I probably want to throw you over here. Yes. It will, oh, it attack, cancels the attack as well, of course. That's awesome. And let's, this, this for good measure, do some damage. There we go. Excellent. See how you like that, you stupid starfish. Starfish are cool, but not when they're the size of a building and trying to kill everyone. Hot take, I know. It's just particularly delicious when I can get the uh, the vec to kill each other. It's just that's just like the icing on the cake. Uh, we go here and shoot the two of you. Boom. Then if I can get go in here and get you to flip your attack. Oh shit. Okay. That's okay. Uh oh. Yeah, let's throw you in the water. Screw you. <laughs> you think a starfish would do better in the water? Oh dear. This is problem. Now you can't shoot there because your minimum range is, is, is there. Oh yes. Yes, if I do this, this will push, oh, it will just push one of them. But that's okay, I can have, no, yes, no, oh, crap. It killed it, but I guess that's okay. I thought it was just going to push it. Yeah, oh, that's stupid. Oh, no, that doesn't work. That doesn't work. Okay, let's reset. Because this, if I take this out, then this can tank one hit and it will be okay. So I can then safely ignore that as long as this is dead. And I can kill it. I'm going to kill it like this. Yes. Oh, that made a hole. Ooh, that creates possibilities. <laughs> um, it's too bad I can't just chuck this in the hole. That would be so funny. No. Okay, so you can take that hit. I just need to stop you. So I could... I could if I throw... Is that going to... Yeah. I can throw you there, and then you're not going to damage the building, you're just going to push it, which doesn't do anything, uh, and then you're going to kill your own mate. Okay, good. And then you can damage you, can kill you, there we go. I love it when a plan comes together. Yes. <laughs> Why did they earn it? They didn't do anything. Okay. Uh, oh, okay. Well, you know what I have to do. Because it's fucking hilarious. Down you go! Whee! <laughs> Into the pit! And you do that. And then you're going to burn. So, uh, yeah, I guess I'll just leave it. Burn to death! Yes. Cool. We did it! Okay, let's try, let's change squads. So bomber mechs, mist eaters. Let's do the fire ones. Fire's good, isn't it? Yeah. Look at that. Let's see what they can do. Damage one of more tiles. Line and push others away. Okay, that's cool. It doesn't actually set things on fire though. Quick fire mech. Fire two projectiles in different directions. Let's see. Standing on fire removes fire and gives the mech boost. Okay. Does that work for all of my mechs or just that one? 
Hmm. Flaming artillery that drops fire on its way to its target. Okay, that's cool. That's cool, yeah. Let's try this one. Ooh, look at that. Pierce mech. Fires a pushing projectile that pierces the first target and damages the second. Interesting. Launch a walking bomb. Unused bombs dismantle after the enemy turn. Cool. Force a nearby unit to swap places with any other unit. See, yeah, that's that's interesting. That's really interesting. Oh, and the upgrades allow it to heal an ally and hurt an enemy. I kind of want to try this one. Let's try this one. I was doing pretty well on hard, wasn't I? Maybe I should do a full run, but I don't know. Let's let's uh, let's uh, let's do this one. Oh, it's another one, the Volatile Vec. I should have read the description. Never mind. Let's just have a quick look at this one. So yeah, if you if you were on the fence about buying this game, well, it's just got even better for the same price. And you know, it's it's, it's these games are so ridiculously discounted these days. If you wait long enough, you can play games on such a low budget. It's awesome. Okay, uh, let's see. What is this one? This is the Piercer. Okay. That'd be cool if there was somewhere I could use it. Uh, what do you do? Walking bomb. Yeah, okay. I think I want to hit you like that so that you, yeah, get in the way of the ver spawning vet. What's this one? Yes, what places? Ah, uh, yes, yes, yes. That could be so cool. I guess I could move one of my units into a place I want the enemy to be and then swap them. <laughs> that would be cool. Yeah, okay, so let's... No target available, why not? Do I have to be close to it? Like you and you. There we go. Excellent. So we took it out of the... Oh, you, you still have a problem, yeah. Can I do this? Oh, it's, it's yeah, the walking bomb. Okay, and I can, it does actually walk. I can make it walk around, it's so cute. Oh, my cute exploding little friend. Um, yeah, where do we want him? Hmm, I don't like that you'll be taking two damage, but I guess we have to deal with it. Let's go here so you can, boom. Oh, yes, and the, I forgot about that. When you kick up sand from the desert tiles, it cancels an attack, because you can't see. Oof. Good. It's that shadow. It's death. Okay, uh, yes, walking bomb, right. Alright, I'm just gonna push you there. Now I can just swap you with you. Good. It doesn't really matter where I throw it, as long as it can. Yeah, so I'm gonna move you here, so you should block the attack, take the damage, and then hit this. Yes, that's nice. I like it. Okay, yeah, harmlessly hit that. Block the thing. Yeah! Oh, it didn't... I only killed it. It didn't explode. Oh. That's too bad. But at least it blocked it. That's, that's, that's of use. Okay, here's fun. I'm gonna... Swap you two. Yeah. So you're hitting your own mate there. Good. And, hmm. Oh. Yes. I didn't think it through. This one's going to hit that. No. Okay. I have to, I just, I'm so excited by the possibilities. I can't do this, can I? No. Alright, let's reset. Well, anyway, I mean, you get the idea, right? I've been playing for fucking hour. I've been playing for an hour. <laughs> I just meant to make this a quick video. Why do I do this? I'll, I'll try to edit it, but Jesus. Uh, I just can't stop. I can't help myself. Okay, I've got a better idea. I'm going to do it with you and you. Yeah, good. <laughs> it's pretty effective. Yeah. It's so it's so cute. I don't want it to die. I want to take it home and be nice to it. So sad. Anyway, yeah. So this is Into the Breach Advanced Edition. It's uh, it's it's a good edition. It, it, ad, an edition of an edition. Yes. Um. Yeah, it's on Switch as well. So if you if you it's it's a little bit trickier to play with a gamepad, but I've played it. I even bought it on Switch as well as uh, as this. So yeah, gives you some idea how much I like the game. 
I bought it twice. Yes, I'm going to do some shenanigans. I'm going to have you go there, swap you with uh, you. Yes, then you. Oh, wait, that wasn't right. No, I screwed it up. Everyone's going to die. It's all my fault. Uh, okay. Never mind. Oh, dear. I'm so fired. Anyway, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Boom! Oh no! What did I do? Oh god! What's happening? That's not my fault. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Boom! Everyone's gonna die. Oh god. Oh.